Seven Little Johnstons has endeared its fascinating family to millions of viewers across America. Far from the typical reality show, it features an otherwise normal family just trying to get by while also living with dwarfism. As matriarch Amber told Good Housekeeping, normalcy was always the goal because other similarly themed shows feature a slightly more heightened reality. Seven Little Johnstons, then, aims to offer an entirely unfiltered look at ordinary, everyday life as experienced by a family just like any other who also happen to be dealing with dwarfism. She told Good Housekeeping, being able to show some of our struggles will be relatable to viewers because it's not just that we're struggling because we're four feet tall, we're struggling to raise teenagers or in our marriage. They are things that everybody can relate to, no matter what. You need to be able to cover the bills 100% on your own. As the happy couple explained in an interview with The Mirror, they met through an organization called Little People, which, as Amber stated, arranges meetups for little people and outsized family members so people can get together, learn about medical things affecting us, and just be around other people with dwarfism. They both are achondroplastic dwarves, which means their dwarfism affects their extremities. Amber and Trent spotted each other across the room at the event and were instantly attracted. But distance kept them just close friends, giving them time to get to know each other better. Plus, Amber had to finish high school. She was only 16 when the two met and had never had a boyfriend before. After two years, she moved to be closer to him. She fell in love with me instantly. They both knew they wanted to get married, and indeed they did, in November 1998, with more than 300 guests present. Within five months, Amber was pregnant with the couple's first child. They had five children total, two biologically and three by adoption, with Amber admitting in an interview with Southern Living that they're very strict parents. As she explained, their method of parenting means, you're going to respect each other, and you're going to respect your elders, and you're going to respect yourself. Alex, can we do it nicely? Before getting pregnant with eldest Jonah, as the proud parents told the Mirror, they were eager to have a child with dwarfism too because, as Amber explained, Trent always wanted a son like him and obviously I want a daughter like me. Their decision to adopt was partly due to the riskiness of another pregnancy and partly to give children with dwarfism a good home. But Amber is realistic about the struggles of being a first-time parent. She told Good Housekeeping, just because we're little people and happen to have little people children doesn't automatically make us folks that know everything about our kids. According to TV shows Ace, fans on Instagram have been criticizing their parenting skills, especially when it comes to the Johnston children moving out on their own. One Instagram commentator said, Trent and Amber have good intentions, but they need to get their stuff together. These kids are going to move out and stay gone. Amber, however, was quick to shut down the negative talk, reminding people that part of parenting is helping their children grow into independent adults. Jonah Trent Johnston. Joseph. Things aren't always perfect for the Johnston family, though, and they're not afraid to show it on television. In 2019, rumors swirled that Trent and Amber's marriage was on the rocks, with Seven Little Johnston's fans pointing to the growing tension between them on the show. The Cinemaholic reported that rumors of the trouble started after Amber's clapback on Instagram. Amber admits that juggling five kids with wildly different personalities can be tough at times. However, she also acknowledged, we know that a relationship, parenting, and marriage is a constant work in progress. With both of us feeling that and knowing that, we don't give up. The proud mother doesn't regret putting her relationship on display for the cameras, reiterating that Seven Little Johnston's aims to get down to the nitty-gritty. As for viewers concerned about her relationship with Trent falling apart as their lives become increasingly complicated, Amber reassured them that no matter what happens, we'll figure it out. We always do. And it seems the couple has. In 2021, they celebrated their 23rd wedding anniversary. They shared a photo on Instagram with the caption, A whole lot of years plus a whole lot of work equals a whole lot of love. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more list videos about your favorite celebrities are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.